Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Rati here. So guys, today I'm going to make a video on how to monetize poetry, how to make money using poetry. Now, as a poet, this is a question that concerns literally all of us if you're, you know, irrespective of the fact whether you're an accomplished poet, an emerging poet, you know, or sort of somewhere in between accomplished and emerging, you always wonder how to make money using poetry. Now, I'll be honest at the outset, it's not easy to make money using poetry. Uh, trust me, guys, nobody is dying to publish your poetry books and poetry is not so much of an in-demand genre directly in the form of books like, you know, let's say non-fiction books or, or fiction. Uh, but having said that, the, the beautiful thing about poetry is that poetry is a very open-ended and creative genre. So even though there are limited avenues for making money through poetry directly, indirectly, you know, if you're a bit smart and innovative, then you can definitely make money through poetry indirectly, you know, in combination uh, with other genres. And there's a lot you can do to exploit the commercial potential of poetry. So in this video, we are more going to talk about like those indirect ways as in how you can make money using poetry, how you can monetize your poetry. Um, a lot of people, you know, even in the comments section, I've done a lot of book series, how to write a poetry book, how to write poetry and, you know, different uh, videos uh, pertaining to poetry tips you can check out on my channel. So a lot of times people actually ask me in comments, you know, that how can I am an emerging poet, how can I make money using my poetry and I need to, you know, sort of somehow find a way to monetize my poems. So let me repeat at the outset. I'm not trying to dissuade you, dissuade you, it's not easy to make money from poetry, but it's not impossible either. And that's why in this video, I'm going to give you a couple of tips on how to monetize your poetry. Uh, so let's, let's get started. So I'm going to start with the unconventional tips. So the first way to make money using poetry, to monetize your poetry, is create poetry uh, merchandise. Now guys, poetry merchandise is getting increasingly popular. What do I mean by poetry merchandise? It simply means that, you know, uh, you use your poetry as, you know, kind of like, uh, you use your poetry as copywriting to sell different kinds of articles from, uh, you know, from coffee mugs to coasters to t-shirts you know and different kinds of merchandise you can uh, think of so it's it's like you know basically uh, two liners three liners or four liners obviously you cannot use your whole uh, you cannot print an entire poem in a coffee mug but it's basically you know using little little snippets of your poetry to create uh, to create this merchandise and you know that obviously combined with the elements of design and you know uh, different kinds of creativity then you can create a tangible product to sell uh, in the market now there are different sites you know where you can there are different so many e-commerce sites where you can sell such poetry uh, merchandise you know to begin with of course amazon is the most common uh, but apart from amazon a lot of offbeat sites you know where you can sell such stuff and which are exclusively you know geared towards creative handmade products for example uh, there is a site called itsy so on itsy you can sell uh, you know, uh, you can sell a lot of poetry uh, merchandise. You can even sell poetry on Etsy, you know, as as down uh, as downloads. And we're going to talk about it, this in the next point. But Etsy allows you to sell your poetry in different forms. And it's an amazing site for selling poetry merchandise. I'm going to include, uh, you know, some screenshots of Etsy. So you can uh, check out Etsy and how you can sell poetry uh, merchandise. So this is, you know, something, of course, for which you will, you will need a little bit of investment and uh, and a lot of creativity you need to sort of you know collaborate with different people I think there are a lot of t-shirt you know startups these days also a lot of apparel startups uh, which actually you know take these quotes from poets and they pay you for those quotes for incorporating on their t-shirts you can check out the internet uh, you know for those kind of uh, for those kind of apparel startups and collaborate with them uh, so create poetry merchandise this is the first most obvious way of you know sort of monetizing uh, first unconventional way of monetizing your poetry second way you, in which you can monetize your poetry second tip is to you know uh, use your poetry as text for greeting cards uh, now this is again getting increasingly uh, popular they're greeting card companies and you can find a lot of those jobs also online you know they're greeting cards uh, companies which actually uh, you know, sort of, um, which would actually pay poets, you know, for getting these 
uh, two liners or four liners f- uh, from them to be used on their greeting cards so you can you know collaborate with one of these companies and sell them your poetry or you can you know design your own greeting cards and sell them online that is if you're good with designing skills so again the options are endless you can sell these greeting cards to different e-commerce sites and uh you can you know if you have a great offline network i think you can even tap uh your offline network you know and sell these sort of uh, poetry uh, greeting cards to poetry lovers friends family etc and you know if you become uh, sort of very good with this if you become a pro with this and people you know can even people would even start commissioning you poetry uh, specific poetry greeting cards but like i said for this you need a lot of creativity it see again the site which i mentioned it see is uh, an amazing site for selling poetry greeting cards as well and uh, just to add to this you know there's another idea uh, related to poetry greeting cards you can also create poetry postcards uh now poetry postcards uh, guys is you know i think it's not something which has been explored so much but this is again uh, something you know which you can uh, you can sell these poetry postcards in offline poetry meets and events as well uh so poetry postcards would essentially be you know visual little visual depictions of your poems and if your poems are you know visual and like uh, uh they sort of look good visually and they can be used to portray a concept uh, then your poems would make good material for poetry uh, postcards you know poems that are too sort of like uh, uh philosophical or poems that are too prosaic i think those kinds of poems are not suitable for poetry postcards but yeah if your poems uh you know have this effect of sound or if they have good imagery then you know as two liners as four liners as even six liners for that matter uh you can use your poems uh as you know uh, to design poetry postcards and then sell these poetry postcards the next step is you can actually sell your poetry as downloads you know instead of selling your poems in like instead of you know uh, getting it out in a whole book form you can actually sell your separate poems as downloads and This is something which again then I would advise you to check out Etsy on Etsy I have actually seen people selling you know their poems as a uh, download so again you know if you are good with designs you could sort of you know give a good design element to your poem and you know have it in a certain frame and then uh, sell your poetry as as downloads to uh as downloads to you know prospective audience to poetry uh poetry readers so there's no dearth of creativity guys you know if you have creativity then uh, you actually can come up with a lot of ideas to monetize your poetry because poetry uh is not a stand alone genre you know the words have sounds the words can be visual the words have music uh, so in collaboration with different other art forms in collaboration with a uh, different genre there are very many exciting ways of monetizing your poetry poetry art again you know is another exciting way so if uh, you are a visual artist yourself or you can collaborate with a visual visual artist and you know you can combine your verse and you know certain kinds of uh, maybe sketches or something like that and you know then you can create these small uh sort of even sketches for that matter you can create uh, small sketches or you know some sort of artworks to monetize your poetry then another tangible way to monetize your poetry is you know you can submit to different po- your poems to different poetry contests this is a direct way of earning money through poetry now, obviously when you submit your poems to poetry contests there's no guarantee that you know you will end up winning that contest but many people do actually randomly win these contests and there are a lot of these contests online so it's worthwhile uh, to submit your poems to poetry contests as well apart from poetry contests there are a lot of magazines a lot of magazines and online journal you know poetry journals and magazines in fact who pay a very good amount of money for publishing your poetry now again obviously since they pay it's uh, going to be competitive and you're going to going to have to sort of like you know wait for a lot of time and it's you know nothing is a given that your poems will be published there but i think if you go on trying and trying it's uh, completely worth it so like so what i'm trying to say that there's certainly a paid market available uh, for getting your poems published and you can go through the magazine you know and sort of have a look at their style and then maybe pitch a poem accordingly so there are two kinds of publications here again one which demand an entry fee and one in which you can uh, submit for free personally i do not think that you know paying an entry fee to uh, get published in a paid magazine is worth it because 
as it is the chances are very low so i if i were you i would go for the free ones you know where you can uh, submit for free so that your money is not wasted even if your poem doesn't get published then another way of monetizing your poetry is but for this you need to be uh you know you need you need to, you need to have a certain level of accomplishment as a poet and you need to have some kind of you know a technical know how about creative writing about you know sort of like you need to have a certain background in the theory of poetry writing uh, as well so you can use this background to create a poetry writing course online you can sell your poetry writing courses on uh, you know sites like uh, coursera and udemy or uh, you can even you know sort of keep a keep a private youtube video you can do a, you can start a poetry writing course through youtube as well and you know make the course open to only to certain paid subscribers so uh, this is again a very uh, you know something which is becoming very popular for monetizing poetry especially amongst poets who are quite accomplished you can uh, run online poetry courses you can even give you know offline poetry courses and offline poetry writing workshops poetry writing workshops are getting a uh, quite popular you know and i'm like a full fledged course you wouldn't have to work so hard and you know you can sort of uh, design a poetry writing workshop on certain themes take a certain theme in mind and you know then directly give these poetry writing workshops at different schools at you know different universities again for all this you know your offline network uh, needs to be really strong if you have to earn money through offline poetry workshops maybe in the beginning you have to give a couple of free poetry workshops and then you know if when your work is sort of uh, getting you know when you sort of make your mark in that field then you will start getting paid for it although again uh, a disclaimer here and my opinion is that you know if you want to monetize something then you shouldn't do it too much for free in the beginning so if you uh maybe one or two is okay but if you get into the habit of giving free poetry workshops to everybody then you know they're going to expect you to do it for free always because in the you know creative in the field of creative writing and arts it's anyways very difficult to monetize our works it's anyways very difficult to sort of uh, have any earning directly because we don't have a professional system to fall back on so we need to create our own system and that's why i think we need to be uh, as poets as writers as artists i think we need to be very strict about monetizing our work and not dole out freebies if we have to monetize uh you, you know our work and earn money using poetry that's what i think then another tip is you can ghost write poetry for other people you know you can a lot of people these days are looking for customized poetry you know it, this can be poetry for their boyfriend girlfriend or you know poetry for their anniversaries or even poetry uh for social issues and causes you can reach out to non profits a lot of uh people are nowadays you know using poetry especially in terms of social media they are using the power of poetry to build up their brands and to get certain uh, messages across to the desired audience so you can work as a ghost writer poet and you know you can write targeted verse for these people of course it's a different kind of an experience altogether you know you're not writing for yourself and uh you know you're not writing according to what you know sort of like what is your preferences but you are essentially uh writing poetry like a copywriter so maybe to some people it might not morally appeal to you as a poet but i think if you have to earn money as a poet this is a very uh, lucrative option and on you know many online sites also you would find such jobs and sites like um on sites like upwork and fiverr you would f- uh, you would find these jobs i've myself seen so many jobs on upwork where you know they require uh customized poetry writing and even insta poetry writing for that matter so uh you know if you just sort of expand your mind and sort of are willing to experiment and think out of the box then there can be a lot of avenues to earn money through writing poetry lastly i would just mention the you know the conventional way of earning money through writing poetry which is that publish your poetry in book form this is of course the tried uh, the most tried and tested and conventional way of earning money through poetry but again having published two books this i can each tell you as a a uh, disclaimer that it's not so easy to earn money you know through poetry in a book form because so if you go through conventional publishing mainstream publishing you know it's good for you to build up a name 
uh, but beyond that you do not get anything so it's not easy to earn money as a poet by publishing your books through mainstream publishing route uh, because you hardly get any royalty you know the, the royalty which you get with mo- most mainstream publishing houses would give you very little royalty would give you very minuscule royalty so the second option then is self publishing uh which you know means that you either self publish like 100% where you can maybe i think combined with amazon you know but then you have to design do the designing and everything yourself but the advantage of you know going 100% self publishing is that all the revenue you earn like of course you divide it with amazon but apart from that all the revenue that you make is let literally pretty much your own so i think uh for people who uh sort of you know have already created a brand out of themselves to considerable extent and who have the resources to market their books uh then you can go for this 100% uh, self publishing otherwise you know there are companies self publishing companies which kind of offer you that service but again then you know you have to shell out a lot of money uh and you know i'm not sure if the profit you will make out of your book is worth it i'm not dissuading you of of course everybody should get a poetry book published at some time and it has immensely uh, helped me also getting these two poetry books published in my poetic journey with these wonderful publishing houses sahit academy and red river uh but like i said that you have to be realistic and in terms of before you get your poetry books published i think you should also keep on trying all these other methods simultaneously to create your brand as a poet because only when you create your brand as a poet will your poetry books really sell uh lastly i would say that you know to monetize your poetry to earn money from your poetry whatever tips you are following it's important for you to create your brand first that's mark that is market yourself as a brand first you know once you uh once people sort of know you and you're a brand out there in the market then uh it's easier it gets way easier to monetize your poetry if you, you know if you're just sort of writing randomly but not sort of like you know creating a presence through social media through offline networks uh, then it's very difficult for you to monetize your poetry so it's most important to Uh, make yourself a brand if you want to make money out of poetry so guys thank you so much for listening if you like the content please do press the like button and please don't forget to subscribe to the channel thanks for listening bye for now